Yeah, keep waving. Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest <laughs> Atari games. Yay. I did have it muted. Hi, Atari. Are you a game? Can I play you? Come here. Come play with no. us. Come no. play. Uh, no. Welcome to After Dark. I need to put the After Dark on the screen. Where is it? There it is. Boom. After Dark. Oh, <laughs> the overlay's under it. Can you get rid of it? Mm -hmm. The overlay? Without screwing everything up? I It'll go away eventually. <laughs> I don't think I can. Oh. It, it'll it'll go away. Yeah, pull's still there. <laughs> yeah. Um, maybe I can, but I'll have to remember to put it back on. Mm. Uh, where is the pole? Let's see. Mm. Main screen. Oh, oh, boom! There it is. Bye, bye, pole. I'll just be like, "Where's the pole?" Next time mm. I do a pole. Mm. There we go. After Dark is After Pole. It's After Pole. Ooh, Chelsea Mal has... Cheesecake. Cheesecake. My goodness. <laughs> that sounds delicious. So, in this After Dark, we're going to be playing INV Plus, a game from 2004. Hello, Rosso Jester. Yep. Thank you for joining us. And Chelsea Mal. Yep. He's... Chelsea Mal. Is that chatting. how it is? I want to know what kind of cheesecake you have. <laughs> um, I'm very intrigued. Mm, cheesecake. Mm, cheesecake. Um... So this is part of the 2600 High Score Showdown Season 6. All right. Um, and we can see it right here. Oh, I need to change the cartridge to the proper cartridge. There we go. Uh, oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. So High Score Showdown Season 6 featuring IMV Plus, Atari 2600. So whenever they have a homebrew, they usually have old school games. Mm. So whenever they have a homebrew, um, we'll play. We play it on the show, because this is very good. Players play this. Um, oh yeah, v version of um, this contest or this. Oh, I see. This high score contest. Yeah. There's also one on the Atari um, H forums as well. They have very good, big high mm. scores as well. So this started on May 1st, uh, ends on May 7th, so four days from now. So we've played on the default game mode, BB, original hardware or emulation. Okay. We'll be doing original hardware. And we just submit a picture. Nice. Uh, but we have a video, but I'll uh, I'll send them a picture too. Send them a screenshot, yeah. And the first comment is, I hate this game so much. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually not, it's pretty good, Space Invaders. Uh, invaders, um, yeah, type game, yeah. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a Space Invaders type game where you shoot things, there's a UFO at the top, it's and you have you have uh, not usually the, my strongest game, but just but straight we'll up see cheesecake. How it goes. Is there a yeah. non-flavored cheesecake? Yeah, just yeah, cheesecake. Just cheesecake. Yeah, okay. plain cheesecake. A really good one can be, if it's so, light and like kind of light. And so fluffy. it's not like ice cream where there's no plain ice cream. Well, there's always a flavor. I would assume there's vanilla in it, but you know, it's okay. it's like a plain cheesecake. And people think of vanilla as plain ice cream when it's actually vanilla. No, ice vanilla, cream. good vanilla ice cream is really good. Oh, you put on like, the sign. Yeah, I did. I can hear something like. Gzz, gzz. <laughs> it's, like a mosquito. It's like neon, except much more annoying sound. Yeah. <laughs> It's this very it's high pitched sound. It's very high pitched. How do you like it, Atari? Atari is just happy. Yeah. He's getting pets. He's uh, a happy cat. So I, I took a look at the high scores so far. Mm -hmm. um, somebody has maxed it out. Yeah. At 9990. And they rolled it, but they didn't say. I guess that's that's the top score, and they're not going for, oh, I did it three times or four times, because there's no way to keep track. So it's the first person who submitted 9990 okay. gets top, and then the second person who submits 9990 gets second. Okay. And that's how it usually happens on games where you can get a top, top score, score, like a maxed out score. Gotcha. The first one there. Yeah. Yeah. Makes the After Dark even more realistic. Yeah. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and that person is Danielle Palo. Nice. And then the next score is 8420, then 4110, 3680, 3050, oh, wow. 3010, 2630. I know you can get on the board there for really? sure. Really? You yeah. think so? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see. Turtle cheesecake. Oh, we're all going to so talk about cheesecake. So that would have caramel now. and caramel, chocolate. Caramel, pecans, chocolate. Pecans. Yeah. Specifically pecans? Yep. Not, not, uh, well, not walnuts, they're pecans. Not peanuts? Nope. I thought there was peanut turtles. Turtles, I believe, have pecans in them. I thought there were always peanuts. No, mm. turtles aren't peanuts. No, okay. no, no, no. So let's boot it up. I don't think so. Well, I think it is. No, I think they're pecans. Uh, we're going to have to look it up. My favorite is um, uh, marble cheesecake with...
chocolate and vanilla mixed pecans. together. Yeah. Yeah, pecans. Yeah. Okay. See, I'm not crazy. Um, well, I always ate them and I thought, oh, peanuts, whatever. Well, you hate well, walnuts. You don't like the I bitterness don't. and that, that, like, that weird dry mouthfeel of walnuts. I like almonds, cashews. Yeah. Peanuts. Yeah. Um, what are the round ones? Macadamia nuts. Macadamias are okay. Yeah. Not, they don't have much of a taste, but they're do crunchy you, at least. Do you like Brazil nuts? I don't know. The big, big ones? The that white? Ever, they're big and large, and everyone, they're always always left behind in the mixed nut. The white? And they're like they're a little bit curved? They're white and huge, and they're like really big, and yeah. like, no one likes, no. no one likes Brazil nuts. Brazil no. Um. Okay, let's do it. I like all nuts. All of them? I think hmm. I do. There are very few nuts I don't like. Even walnuts? I love, I love uh, hazelnuts. They're delicious. Okay, load it up. I like walnuts, too. They have their place, especially in, in dark chocolate brownies. Walnuts. Little bits of walnuts. Oh, not, so good. Not big ones, because they're just too bitter. Too, too bitter. No. Oh. I mean, pecans are, I think, superior walnuts. Because they have the bitterness, mm. they're less bitter, but they have the same texture. Okay. So, INV Plus is an original take of the Atari of uh, the arcade classic Space Invaders for okay. the 2600, and was a collaborative effort between Eric Mooney and Piero Cavina. Mm. This is the only version of Space Invaders for the 2600 at the time to feature 11 invaders per row, matching the arcade in this regard. Mm. INV also uh, features simultaneous two-player mode, which we won't play mm. because that's not the contest. Mm -hmm. Um, and INV is a successor to INV. INV Plus is a successor to INV with several improvements over the original game. Scoring more, more closely matches the original game. PAL support has been added. Added Invisible Vaders mode. Player death sequence improved. Hidden and Easter egg added. New full color manual. Several bugs were fixed. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so you press the button to start. It is couch compliant. And you shoot the things. Don't get shot. So it's, it's quite a defensive game. Because the shots come down fairly quick. Oh gosh, they yeah. do ever. So there's two strategies to space invaders. Yeah. One. And get the edges. Get the edges because it makes them go down slower. Because when they hit the edge, that's when they come down a level. Uh, you definitely want to get that for points. So the longer oh. that's on the screen, the less points you get for oh, it. Oh really? So I think it starts at a 200 or at least 150. And it goes down to 50 if you leave it all the way to the end. Then the other strategy... Oh, is to get the bottom row. Is to get the bottom row because they come down really quick. And that gives you more time to not get shot. I'm, I'm just... So it's kind of a... This game. You're working them in from the bottom and then from the edges as well. But edges more... Ah! Edges more so at first. Because that'll slow them down completely. Um, so last time we... <laughs> I'm not oh, no. dodging very well. I'm not very good at this game. You'll get I better. You, I think you'll you'll get a higher score than I will for sure on this one. <laughs> I'm not paying attention. 790. Oh, my goodness. T790. No, no, no. Is anybody going to keep track? No. Not of that score. Don't even keep it. Embarrassment. Embarrassment is Just correct. An embarrassment. Piero Cavino did Oystron as well. Oystron is awesome. Oystron's a really, really good game. Ah. So it's very uh, old school homebrew uh, creator. Um, so last time we played this game, Thomas Yench posted about a 4K Space Invaders arcade homebrew that he was working on. Um, and he said, I didn't know about INV3 before because we played INV, INV Plus, oh, and INV3. And he said, actually, that looks pretty much like my own attempts at displaying 11 invaders. Um, but in my demo, the invaders are moving and equally spaced. Um, I also had a version with shields, but setting up the shields required a lot of kernel lines or more RAM, which required to be too big a vertical gap between the shield and invaders, so I eventually abandoned the project. Oh, oh so close. Oh, come on. Um, but then he started up the project again okay. after we played INV Plus last time, which was... Um, 20, when did we last play this game? 2010? June 3rd, 2020. Yeah, we played all three. Uh, other games by Piero Cavina. Ah, <laughs> they shoot a lot. Ivy Plus, Mondo Pong, and Oystron. Oh, you almost finished the level. Nope, nope. Gonna die. Oh, yeah, lots <sighs> of chances. Nice! Oh. 990. 
Oyster on is a classic of homebrews, yes. Yeah, and I have it on cartridge up there. So good. Actually, one of my first games I bought was Oyster on, I believe. Very early on. Um, let's see, what else? So... Thomas Yench got up to version 0.3 where um, there were destructible shields and you could shoot the invaders but the development stopped around mid-2020 so hopefully he'll pick that back up again because he had a very good version of Space Invaders going. Um, ah. Maybe he forgot about it. So maybe this will uh, jog his memory and he can continu continue on with it because he didn't have the invaders shooting down yet. That's one thing he didn't have. I think he was running out of um, time in terms of screen time to, mm. to put everything on the screen. Because he had the destructible shields. They were really nice destructible shields. Oh, oh one more life. No. Careful. Oh. oh. 1670. Not great, not great. Much better than last time. Oh. My turn. Okay. See how I can do. Yeah, you'll get further. So, Ugh, it's very intense. He like had yeah. intense gaming face on when I'm playing this. Yeah, Space Invaders, the noise. Dun, 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 dun. Ah, the march of the invaders coming down yeah, the screen. Yeah, yeah. Nice. Call it resting space invader space. <laughs> resting space. Oh, I got oh it. you got it. I think I feel like that was entirely accidental. Hundred percent accidental. <laughs> I only got fifty for it too. Or maybe it's random. Is it? I that thought you said if you get it early. Screen. No, because I was playing this just to make sure it worked on the system. Mm -hmm. Like one time, and I was getting one fifty, mm -hmm. and I thought I got it early, but I think it's just random. I need to be more precise. I shoot like oh. Like, oh. I have unlimited bullets, but in reality, you don't get to shoot again until you shoot once, right? So Until it hits. That's, I know, I know. That's the issue. It's very panicky. Especially it's a panicky game. It does make you kind of freak out if you're not calm. You won't do well. No. You have to be calm at the end. Nice. Lost a life, though. It was not good. It was not good at all. You should be shooting the other end. Mm, meh. Uh, either end. Maybe not. I, I shoot the other end because I feel like you have more time to get them as it goes you that do, way. You do, you do. But they're still going to come down a row. Oh, yeah. It's better to stick at an end mm -hmm. because then you don't have waste time moving. True. Very true. No. Uh, not even close. Close, but no cigar. No, nah, not even close. They only shoot one shot at a time. Yeah. So you're safe while the bullet's coming down. But as when they're closer, they you don't see you don't get much warning when they're very That's close to the That's why you got to get ground. rid of the bottom row. Oh, oh, they're shooting more than once. That is not true. Yeah, they're shooting. Oh, oh I went right into no. that. Terrible. Well, you beat me. Nice. <sighs> Twenty thirty. Random sounds about right. Yeah. What did I get? No, I didn't get the UFO. So we didn't find out. There is auto fire. Is there? You still have to wait though. Yeah, I don't I don't find that's necessarily if you're doing rows, that's not too bad, actually. Oh, no! Ugh, 2490. Oh, you're done? Oh, that was uh, good. I gotta... Yep, it's okay. James, 2490. Got some official scorekeepers there, Vitoko. Someone will jump in, I hope. Yeah, thank you. 2490. Did I make it on the board yet? No. It's 26. No, 2630. I will next, the next game. Thank you, Vitoko. And Charles Wheeland. And Charles Donny Mao. <laughs> Charles Donny Mao is typing very strange very, numbers very. and letters, like in the middle. <laughs> I don't know if that's helping or 
hindering. <laughs> oh. oh no. Last time I, I could get further oh, over, but no. Uh, no, I'm just gonna die. Yeah. Okay, start over. That was that Rage was reset. Bad. Rage reset is correct. They do aim for you though. They do aim for you. Like it's not random where they're shooting. They shoot near you. Otherwise it'd be a lot easier. Oh yeah. Because there's so many rows that could be shooting. It's always one that's kind of close to you. They, they do shoot randomly as well, but I find it's maybe about two out of three shots are near you, I would say. Couch compliant rage reset, yes. Just dying. Like some games you can do that, just, uh, I'm just gonna die quick, and then you can restart. Some it's like, oh uh, no, no, I have to reset. It's too hard to die. I reject your num number letter duality. They're all ASCII characters. <laughs> oh no. Because he's mixing, he put like two J's in with the <laughs> score, like in the middle of the score. <laughs> It's all about how the uh, computer reads the numbers as they're inputted. Yeah, you can mix the letters in. Just reaches a letter and, and it goes, okay, that's the letter. That's fine. I always assume that they're going to shoot where I am. Oh, they do. You have to move away right away. So I shoot, move away. Move, shoot. Oh, oh no. Well, that was terrible. Oh, no. You want here. That is not a better don't. score. Nope, it is not. Last is one was a, better. That is a worse 26, score. 2670. They do gun for you. Oh, yeah. Oh, they moved in the way. That was aiming, that was going right for it, for sure. I love how they flip back and forth <laughs> flip, 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 to flip, show flip, their flip. movement. Flip, 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 flip. Yeah. They almost, they become, they become uh, a oh. new entity when they Can't flip really fast. Oh, oh, he's distracting he's me. Not, Get away. He's not, he's not, he's not, don't worry. He is. Just he's shoot it. He's amp. He's not. He's almost on the amp. Don't touch him. What are you doing? Get, 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 get. I'm going to start over. <laughs> so distracting. Kittens, come here. Oh, oh, that squeak is so Come pathetic. Here. Come here, pathetic squeaker. <laughs> we know what you're up to. <laughs> Kitten very chaos. Transparent. <laughs> we know what you're up to. Come here. Somebody type kitten chaos? Yep. <laughs> he is, Definitely kitten chaos. He's a uh, chaos cat. Ah! Ah! They're getting in my way. Are you a chaos cat? Chaos. Chaos cat. Captain Chaos. Captain Chaos. Cat. 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 <laughs> Meowington Chaos. Meowington Chaos. Yeah. Sir Meowington Chaos. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, poor Meowington. He's he's putting up with this, but he's not very happy with it. <laughs> yeah. That's pretty much described. <laughs> all, cats. all cats. He's putting up with this, but he's not very happy. <laughs> oh, he's giving me giving stink me stink eye, stink eye, hairy eyeball. Oh, oh my god! That was like two. That's why he got me. Because he shot two down. Terrible. It's all psychological warfare with this cat. He's like, you're doing well. I'm going to start chewing on the quartz on the amplifier. Oh my god. <laughs> oh no! I think they start lower each round. Just a little bit lower. You might be right. They might start a little faster. I don't know. I don't. Um, I didn't notice it between level one and two, too. but mm. see if you shoot them on the edge, you only have to worry about that bullet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have to be slightly ahead of it. Yeah. Lower for sure. Yeah.
Ah, no. <gasps> I think so. No. Mm -hmm. Terrible. Not even close to my last score. Okay. <laughs> Chaos. Why? Why, cat? I think you threw me off my game. Those are some bad deaths. Bad deaths. Useless deaths. Gotta play more defensively. I think I'm going too crazy. know whether it's worth it going it probably is worth it going for the ufo at least mm. at the beginning mm. oh no feline interference UFO for you. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was close. <laughs> shield actually saved you. The shields in this game... You you are, shoot through them. Uh, well, you shoot them. And you wear them down, but you don't shoot through them. They don't shoot through them either, so they're kind of annoying. At the same time, they're helpful. You shoot through them. No, no, oh, no. I, what I meant no. to say was you break you break them up if you oh, shoot them, too. Just like they do. Is that true for space invaders as yeah. well? Yeah, it's the same. They're both blocking you and them. Oh. So they don't really help or hinder, but they also do help and hinder. Ah, come oh, on! No. Oh, they're right down to the bottom. But not that one! <laughs> no! <laughs> I didn't want that one. Oh, that was terrible. Yeah. Boo! Boo! <laughs> Boo, Boo <laughs> indeed. Oh my goodness. Everybody should play along at home. <laughs> Mm -hmm. See how see how well they do. I'm Post guessing, your scores. I gotta I gotta ask people what they. That's the next poll. I've got the co next poll. I know what it is. Yeah. Yeah. What they want what the us. What they want us to play or? <laughs> no. Oh, nice. Nice. One shot. Very nice. Not what they. Not when they want us to play. There's too many options. That we'll do that one day. Well, we should do it with a, a random, plus card. Play a game, have people play, and just just continually yeah. update on the on the Twitch live stream what scores people are, are posting. I, I that have, would be fun. Yeah, viewers' choice um, day. I yeah. do have that uh, in the schedule, but I, I just think that would be fun. I've never. Uh, you have to plan it. ahead for it though. Um, so people know you're playing bit. it. I don't know. Well, the people probably want to know what you're playing ahead of time. Well, it's oh, not, it's not viewers' choice then, is it? Oh, I see what you're saying. Well, if viewers' you choice, ahead. you would just have a poll ahead of time. And... Oh, out of X games? Yeah. Yeah, it's better when it's random. Like, completely random. Random? But that's no Not random, choice. But, no, but people decide. Oh, well... Out of well, infinite games of homebrews. Well, yeah, I guess so. Yeah. It'd be a lot of choice, though. Yeah, they could choose terrible, like... Purposely not terrible? terrible? <laughs> games, but tedious games that take a long time and... What is it, that bus hard. game? <laughs> oh, yeah. Desert bus? Desert bus. <laughs> See, that was 100. Yeah, that was 100. So. Does this have two-player option? It does. Yes. We're not playing it today, but it does have a two-player. Yeah, because we're going for a high score on one player. Oh, that was close. Gotta get these low ones. Get too close. Good job. Thank 2130, you. that's good. Yes, yeah, yeah, it's getting you there. Still got your lot of, lot of lies there. I lost one stupidly. Uh, still doing pretty well. Not allowed to say that I'm doing well. No, you're not doing well. You're just you're Terrib just doing just doing. Barely surviving. You're just playing. Oh. Too hard. Too many things in the way. 
Fifty eight at a lower yeah, the lower levels. Oh, they're getting really low. They started real Oh <gasps> Risky! Mm -hmm. Don't Very be too risky. risky. It is risky. Oof. Because they're so low. No, it's not too bad. Maybe I should take out the bottom row first then. The next bottom time. two, I don't, I don't know. know. I don't know. It's too hectic right now to deal with UFOs. Oh, oh damn it. Didn't want to shoot nice. that Nice. Good job. <sighs> Two simultaneous Yuck. players. Two. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> Boo. Boo. <laughs> 3140. That was good. I'm on the board now. Mm. On the board. What place am I in now? I'm in fifth place. As of when I recorded the scores. Oh, so close. Don't. Don't go after the UFO if it's going to put you in danger. Not worth it. Oof. Shield helped you there. <laughs> Risky. Risky business. Oh! <laughs> Scary. Oh! Mm. Went the wrong way. Get that UFO. Two. Oh, no. You get cornered because if you move, oh my god, <laughs> it doesn't even give you a second to restart. A little bit, but you were oh, complaining. It's brutal. Oh my god. Chelsea Donnie Mao is putting in scores. Uh, there's something, uh, they're not numbers, <laughs> <laughs> they're like backwards numbers and symbols. He's like doing incantations on the uh, <laughs> incantations. On nice. The, on the uh, on the chat there. I think Cthulhu is speaking through him. <laughs> Upside down scores. But what is that thing? And that's like an arrow. That's like a like a crazy. Lightning bolt. Oh god. Oh I see it's it's my score. Zero. But the numbers are all out of order. <laughs> oh three, one, that's a four. I guess there's no upside down four. Closest I could get to a four. Oh that's what it is, yeah. Whoa. Oh my god, there's they stump so much of their shot when they start moving fast. Oh my god. No, stay out of the middle of them. Stay I'm not away. trying to get into the middle of them. I'm trying to get the lowest ones. No. Oh. Good job. Hey, the pole is closed. I can turn it back on now. So you don't forget it? Yes. Oh my god. Brutal. Oh, it didn't go away. No? I guess closed and going away is two different things. Oh no. Boom. It's it's horrible when you're on that edge. Yeah. Because you, you get trapped. Don't and, be pushed, yeah. And then you, oh, you you'll get good. pushed into a shot. I'm not even trying for it. I'm trying not to die. It's uh it's a good strategy. Agreed. Don't get hit. But it's not just good enough in this game not to get hit. No. You they are relentless. They just keep coming down. This was the first big arcade game, wasn't it? Besides Pong. After Pong, this was the first, the next big hit, oh, I believe. Oh God, I, I cannot get under them and shoot them. Is that, your net, is that a better score than no. you got before? No, no, it's not. My first score was probably the best. <laughs> no, it was. Something. Yeah, no. Stop uh, on doing this. 16 something, I think. Anyway. Mm. <sighs> Boo. Boo. Side down score, nice. Good luck. Yeah, there we go. 
Come on. Stupid thing. Get out of the way. I think I'm going to go for the bottom ones uh, now after a couple rows. But this is what I have such trouble is once they get low, it's really yes. hard to do the bottom rows because they start shooting so close to you. It's hard to dodge them. And you got to get rid of them. I know. It's It, it might be better point. to do the bottom two rows first and Maybe. then get the sides. Maybe. I don't know. They start coming down fast. Yeah, but it's... I would say a couple rows on the... Uh, a couple columns. And then a couple rows. And then do the whole two bottom rows. Yeah. I always shoot them from the leading edge. Oh, it's... Uh, yeah, you have to, but then you, you if you're not careful, you will get trapped. Yeah. That worked out pretty well, actually. <clears throat> yeah, there used to be whole arcades that were just Space Invaders. Just yeah, space. I know big. it was a huge thing in Japan. Like Space Invaders is everything. In oh Japan. yeah, we we were in Akihabara and there was like was we the were 40th in a fortieth anniversary of them. Yeah, there was a a little or arcade 30, 30 there years? where you they had claw hands and they'd get different games. And, everything was about and Space Invaders. And it was Space Invaders like fortieth anniversary. Yeah. yeah, in Tokyo. Nice one fifty. That'll add to my score. Oh, I gotta get out of here. Yeah, get out of that corner. Oh, these dangerous. stupid... Oh my god. <sighs> Damn it! Waste of a life. I went through the shield. Oh, terrible. Terrible. I swear that went through the shield. Mm -hmm. See, that one didn't because there's a hole in it. The other one did. It went through the shield. Arr. Time. So low. There we go. It is a frustrating game. Like, very few games make you so frustrated as dying on Space Invaders. I just wish there wasn't any shields at all. Well, it's part of both the... <gasps> Damn it! No. Oh, you scared the cat. <laughs> oh, kitty. 32.40. I don't know. Is that better or worse than I my last score? I think that was score? good. I don't remember. 32.40? I can't scroll up. Oh, yeah, I can't. Yeah, it's a little bit better. Ugh, it's two... A couple of terrible deaths there. Uh, what's the next one I have to beat? Um, 36.80. I can do that. If I beat 36.80, I'll be very happy. Because you get about a thousand a level. Depends on which one you shoot. They're all worth different points. Are they? So I'm gonna see how much you get for one level without a UFO. Oh, come on! <laughs> Trying to 100 dodge. Better. 100 better is not much better. But it is better. It's an improvement. but I'm 
I, uh, <laughs> I really wish I had I somewhere to sit this flat on my lap. Is it too, too much movement? Well, because I cross my legs. I'm very uncomfortable. I can't sit flat-legged. Um. So it, sometimes I'm hitting hitting the diagonals when I should be straight. Ah, that that wasn't that <laughs> issue, but that's sometimes uh, something I... No, 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 it's fine. It's not, it's not a game I'm expecting to get a very high score on, so... I, what I don't like is that you can't go right to the edge. Like, they, they go past yes, you. Yes, that's, I think, on <sighs> purpose, for mm. sure. Yeah, it is on purpose, so you get caught. Mm -hmm. There's very few, like, mistakes in video games where... Because they're so well-planned out and play-tested that... It's like, no, like they go a little bit further this way. They start this Ooh, height. I oh, got good job. <laughs> I'll have to deduct that from the amount. I'm already down to like no lives, so. Yeah. I doubt I'm going to make it to the end. You can do it. No, I doubt it. Then they start going really, really fast. Oh. Man. oh. Okay, so Boop. watch watch for how many points I get. For a full level? For a full level. Yeah, minus whatever the UFO is. Yeah, if I get one. I think you're right. I think there's about a thousand. Oh. Rage reset. <laughs> Rage reset. I was tempted to wear that t-shirt, but I thought, oh, I'm not going to do any rage mm -hmm. resetting tonight. Mm -mm. I did. Mm -hmm. Shields. <laughs> so annoying when you miss because it takes so long to go off the screen. Oh my god, come on. Oh, come on. Tracked 100. From whatever score it is. Thank you for following. Oh, so it's 990. Hmm. Who, who followed? Can you please I say the name? Should be on the chat. Should be on the screen when it came up. You didn't look. I, it wasn't in the chat. It's in that list. In the middle of the screen in the bottom. It says subscribers, followers. No, I have no clue. Followed you this minute. Yep, Head Blender. Person. Woo! Head thank you. Head Blender? Head Blender. Thank you for following. Yeah. I didn't see it. It didn't show up in the chat, though. I, uh, oh, I don't think it does. I don't think it does. It's just on the screen. I think if you choose to show it in the chat, you have uh, to choose it. Yeah, that's you have what to I add noticed. a message or something. Yeah, like I, I noticed that with the subscription. I didn't realize you had to... Type post message. a message for your anniversary or whatever it was. <laughs> hey, head blender. Glad you're enjoying watching. Uh, or us watching us get mad. What is it? IMD? Space Invaders! Very basic Space Invaders. IMD Plus. IMD Plus. I actually kind of like the Space Invaders. <laughs> They're really cute. They're like blocks that, that wiggle back and forth. Wiggly blocks. Wiggly blocks. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> That could describe a lot of Atari 2600 <laughs> games. Wiggly blocks. <laughs> Lots of wiggly blocks. What are we blocks. playing? We're playing the wiggly blocks today. That can describe oh, I'm Pong. at the edge of the screen. <laughs> Especially if you're playing paddle games. Yeah. I was at the edge of the screen and I got caught because I couldn't move over anymore. Wiggle Vaders. Yeah. Wiggle Vaders. Yeah, like it. That's the next uh, the next homebrew version of Space Invaders will be Wiggle Vaders. Damn it, damn it! <laughs> Don't! I'm trying to get all these bottom ones because they're so close. <laughs> In blockers. Nice, nice. In blockers. Nice, I like it. God damn 
that. Okay, got all those low ones. Took me so long, now the, now the tall ones are low ones. Stupid... Bloody... Oh my god. Stop it! Close. Saved by my shield. Oh, <laughs> Very nice. They start so low. Yeah, they get lower. How does lower. anyone? How does anyone get past those levels? I don't. Trapped. Know. I am trapped. <gasps> Ooh. Damn it! <laughs> Need to make some room for myself. anyone has ever created a Space Invaders on like a modern system with super high-res graphics. Oh, yeah. oh, but all yeah. it is is the blocks moving back and forth. You oh. know, like really high-res <laughs> graphics. Like Many with, pixels with crazy, per block. Yes, with crazy they they animations. Have. Have. And then it just goes back and forth across the screen. I think that would be they have. awesome. Really? Yeah. It's like lots of particles going everywhere and it's crazy. It's crazy, but I... Oh. oh no! There's some nineties good. That's no, good. it's not enough. Is it? It's not enough. It did better than last time. Oh, it is enough. <laughs> it is enough. Okay, one more for me. I'll do one more after. Okay. It is enough. Okay. At least one more. Fourth place now. As of the scores that I recorded. Ah. <sighs> such an infuriating game because you know you can do better that's the pro those that's a good game when you play it and you don't think it's unfair when you died well yeah it's like oh, unfair deaths are the worst it's like your death is at your own hand it's like oh you should have been able to dodge that it's totally your fault for not being more careful or whatever it is not moving the right direction it's, it's games where you feel that you're in complete control and you still die is is when it feels really fair oh, and when you get mad at yourself. End. Dave and Busters have some fun giant LED screens for Space Invaders feel very modern retro. And that's how they've been reinvigorating a lot of those old school games. Um, is, is, is like keeping the basics, but playing. Keeping the exact basics, but like it's all crazy and the explosions are big but the actual blockiness is still there for the uh -oh. no no uh -oh. no we haven't died that that way yet Whew. i think the whole game's over when that happens yeah i know it is it is like, i don't think no matter you how on. many lives you have it's it's done maybe maybe not I don't know. no no it is, it is? Yeah. yeah because i i think there's nothing left it, it's not like it's going to start back up at the top <laughs> RC70 says, well, close. <laughs> it was close. I think the VCS is doing a lot of that, too. Like the new VCS. The new VCS. They're taking these old... <laughs> oh, terrible. These old IPs that they have, that they own. Yeah. And, and making them better, like Breakout and... Oh, I don't know if they've safe. done Space Invaders, but... Because they're they're familiar to people, right? And people like them. And they have really great gameplay. So if you just up the graphics, make them modern. Oh god. Oh boy. My eyes go. Alright, fifteen hundred. <laughs> so you're first... I've been broken my I think my my best score was sixteen hundred in the first round, so That's what happens. Uh, I'm always best in my first round. Did we discuss that last show? Yeah, did we? Or maybe it was with, with Darcy? Darcy? Is the Curve of video game uh, abilities. Also, my terrible uh, pool playing is the same. I always find when I play pool, my first game is the best, and then it all just goes downhill from there. <laughs> because of the drinking? <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> the beer doesn't usually help, but... 
I like pool. I haven't played pool in a long time. Yeah, we haven't played pool. You know, there's a pool hall up the street from us, and too. And now that there's no And they smoking, have pizza. Now that there's no smoking... Yeah, compared to the 90s. I might actually go. Yeah, that's true. It's actually a good idea. Yeah, we should go and Nobody we know has a pool table anymore, so... No, I'd be terrible. If we're just playing against each other, that's fine. Nobody can afford the space to have a pool table. That's true. Not it's in this like, We need to use this space up for people. Beds. <laughs> I mean, oh there was a time when it was the coolest thing to have a pool table in your house. Yeah, a pool and a pool table. A pool and a pool table, yeah. You were the cool kid on the block if yeah. your parents had a pool and a pool table. I never had either. <laughs> nope. Nope. I knew people had pools. I, uh, pool table? Uh, like a couple. But a more God. pools than pool tables. Yeah, see, I don't... Who had a pool when I was growing up? Not that many people. No? No. But I mean, growing up in, in Ontario and in Ottawa where it's cold <laughs> and there's snow on the ground, I think people <laughs> feel a little less inclined to have them. Some people do. I mean, yeah. I don't remember a lot of people having pools when I was growing up. No? Oh my God, I Actually, not a lot of people had pool tables either. Deprived Ontarians. I don't know. Second game was Tanny's best one. Okay, second <laughs> yes, game. Yes, your second. First one, you're like, ah, that was yeah. terrible. Let me play again. I'm gonna get this one. Oh, oh. one pixel off. That's all it takes. Risky. <laughs> Like it. Oh, it went. Oh, I swear it went through that shield. I'm gonna review the footage and then write the developers. Koka says if you're going for score, you have to hit the UFO. Yeah, you need the score. Uh, probably. You still have to get all the invaders, though. I mean, yeah, the UFOs are, are a lot of points. Hmm. 150 to 150, which actually they're not that many points. It does help, but... Oh, just missed it. Gotta get out of there. Mm -hmm. But we did have at our local like strip mall a pool hall. Yeah, there's always lots of pool halls. Yeah. Which I think are less popular now than they were in the nineties. I, I feel like they were a lot more popular. I uh, maybe yeah. I'm wrong. Maybe they're still out in the suburbs. We're not in the suburbs much anymore. But like bowling alleys and pool halls oh, yeah. were both very very popular. And I remember having a lot of bowling parties growing up. Oh, tons of bowling parties. Yeah. <laughs> and we the do, do the single-handed five-pin bowling That's in Canadian. Canada. Yeah, very yeah. Canadian. It's good I for didn't kids. even uh, Yeah, it was. And so a lot of kids bowling parties would be the five-pin. Maybe that's Probably um, bowling. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> it's more popular in Canada because kids could play it. Maybe. But um, there was there was I a hadn't smaller played Oh, come on! No! Ten pin until much later in life. Heck yes, five pin! Yeah! Five pin. five pin was fun. You could hold it in one hand and really, like, launch it. Like, I don't know. I oh, no! <laughs> Why? Yeah, old style. It's a very Canadian five pin bowling. I don't know where it originates from. Is it... It's Canadian. Is it Canadian? Completely? Yeah. yeah. Hmm. There's... Uh, I think so. There's all, it's, there's not, one, there's, it's, it's not based on some other European tradition know, or something. Maybe. I don't know. Um, there's also another one in the U.S. where it's like pin, like thin pins or... Oh, uh, okay. I can't remember. remember hearing about it. I've seen bumpers set up for the kids. Yes, yeah. that helps too. Um, for but I don't... Kids. But for five pin... Five pin because the ball is smaller too with kids. They can kind of hold it in two hands and launch yeah. it. It's a lot easier than the ten pin bowling. Bowling and pizza. Bowling yeah. And pizza. 
that's a good night out right there. Yep. Chuck E. Cheese. Yeah. Do they have bowling at Chuck E. Cheese? I don't no. think so. They just had the arcade they games arcade and the pizza. Games. And if I recall the pizza ball. and skee ball. That's kind of bowling. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Skee ball is kind of like five pin, actually. Um, well, much well, smaller. It's much smaller, but yeah. I haven't played five pin in a long time. A lot of the, a lot of the bowling alleys now are a ten pin, I find. Oh, my God. I'm very distracted listening to your story. I know. Bowling. I'm talking about bowling. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I, I was hoping to some. calm you down. <laughs> no. Nope. Rage reset. Correct. Uh, if I recall, Chuck E. Cheese had terrible pizza. Oh, garbage. It was so just thin awful. and trashy. Fifty. I get that with like two. Basin mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Recycle pizza. Recycle pizza, I've yeah. heard. Don't eat pizza while playing bowling. The ball would slip in an ugly Oh, yeah. Way. Yeah, usually it, it was after. <laughs> you need a bowling Space Invaders combo game so you can concentrate properly. Yeah, like a, <laughs> a, a, a Wii uh, bowling. Yeah. And then you take a break, eat eat pizza and play Space Invaders at the arcade <laughs> at the bowling alley. It's true. Like that. That sounds like a good night. Oh my god. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Get him. Good job. Kitten says good job. All I need to do is clear four boards. Yeah. Just they get so low. Stop missing! Stupid shields. Get in my way. I'm getting really good at doing it. Nice. Yeah, they do start up automatically. <laughs> you can't just sit there and press the button to start. It starts on its own. Like the arcade, give me your quarters! Uh, when I was a teenager, it all shifted from pizza to Tex-Mex. <laughs> Going yeah? to Tex-Mex restaurants, yeah. No, no, no! I feel like that was a 90s trend too. It didn't last a long time. Tex Mex? Oh, yeah. Very popular for. Oh, no! Ooh. What the hell? They're too low. That's true. I it's gotta... the shooting when they're low, is, is brutal. Because you barely have time to see it and dodge it. I want to be like six inches from the screen. They're super low! They are deadly low. Deadly. Stop being a shield. It's really annoying. Stop it! You can't rely on it because they shoot through it. Yeah, they get through it pretty fast. Ugh. How low they are! No! At least I got him. He shot me. Gotta get 
get out of here. That's actually better. <laughs> Oh. oh no, 3900 is good. 3900 is oh, good. Oh, stop on that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 3900. For my screenshot. <laughs> Submission screenshot. Nice. Good stuff. All right. That was fun. Very fun game. Yeah, very, Thank very you for fun. keeping track of the scores of a token, yeah. Charles Whelan and uh, Charles Tony Mao typing in weirdness. <laughs> you are eyeing the amp. You need to be here with us. Is he looking for treats? Is it still treat time or no? Uh, Is that still an option? I don't know whether there's. Mm. Yeah, we played quite a bit. Only 6,000 more to go. <laughs> I know. Uh, yep. Yummy, 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 yummy. Oh, did you hear him? He went meow. Meow. I try not to give him too many now because he gets a lot of treat times in. <laughs> yeah, don't you? And very insistent. He's a, <laughs> he is. He's such an insistent cat oh. now about treat time. Yeah, here. There you go. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Yummy, 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 yummy. yummy, yummy. So thanks for hanging out yes. and encouraging us to get high scores. Mm -hmm. So I got in fourth place with that, uh, fourth place. Unless somebody has posted another score. They're really good players in that tournament. Oh yeah. So. Well, if someone hit the highest score, I mean, that's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's so gentle with it. He just goes, and he barely looks at it. Yeah. She's he like, kind of uh, goes, uh, it's uh. over there. And then he looks you in the face and goes, ding. Yeah. <laughs> Watch him. Watch this. Yeah? He looks at it? No, oh, he was looking at it this time. this time he looked at it. I've seen other times where he's like, bing, and it's, it's behind, like behind him. It's like behind his Ding. back. Ding. <laughs> uh, you're a funny kitty. Three more to go. You can do it. <laughs> Very graceful. Yeah. So next episode on <laughs> um, Friday. Mm. We're playing Muddy Vision's Secret Homebrew. Ooh. I know what it is, but you don't. I don't either. So you'll find out on <laughs> you'll find out on Friday. Yeah. And Tanya will be here for that. Yeah. Two we'll more kittens. Lots of fun on Friday. Ding. Ding. Thank you, Charles Wieland. And we'll try and find another 7800 game to match with that as well. Left fluffy Atari. Yeah. He is left-handed. But he does hit it with both, depending on does what side. He? Yeah, we tried it last time. Do you remember? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> it's almost always all left. left. Yeah, almost all left-handed. Yeah. Lefty, fluffy. Yeah, I think it's one of the one of the pitfalls. Yeah, I, you mean the seven eight hundred game? One of the pitfalls. Oh, mm. pitfall two. There's another pitfall. There's pitfall. Is there? Yeah, Is it's it also called something else. Yeah, I can't remember. Pitfall: The Mine Adventure. Mm. But it's very, very similar to the other pitfalls. It is a um, 2D mm -hmm. platformer of types. Um, I've never played that one. Played Pitfall 1 and 2, of course. Yeah. But, uh, oh wow, a third tree time. Yeah. Well, there's an after dark. You get more yeah. fit in into an after dark. <laughs> Fall pit. Fall pit. Fall yes. pit. Yes. Oh, there's that 70. Remember that 7800 game we played uh, that somebody didn't work on for a long time? Then we played it on the show. Oh, yeah. And somebody updated. It's this jumping. A huge map. Yes. Oh, I hope they finished that. Is that the one you There's go off the screen bugs. and you go up levels? Yes. Like, yeah, that was just really good. Four way scrolling. Oh, yeah. Huge map. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, that's such so a good excellent. game. I yeah. can't remember what that's called. Yep. Yeah. I'll have to like leave a note. Hey, any updates for this? <laughs> yeah. I can't remember what the last problem was with it. Didn't it end abruptly? Oh, it crashes. It crashes at the end. Yeah. 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 Um, it was fun though. It was really good. But did we have that cart when we played it? I'll have to look back because if it doesn't no, crash with that cart. No, but I thought it cart... hit the end of the level. Like we hit a level and then there was nothing on the screen. Is that the one you're no, talking it about? No, went a blank screen, I think. Oh, there was one we played and you had to pick up multiple yeah. things and then get off the screen. And then you just hit a level and it was like the level wasn't completed. Oh. But I don't know if that's the same one you're thinking of. I cannot remember names. No, no uh, you'd have to look, we played look it back like two years at ago. it. Oh no, this is this was the, much sooner. This one of the, was not yeah, long ago. one of the first seven eight hundred games we played. Okay. So I was really looking forward to playing it. Not yeah. Penultima, no. Um, oh, I can't remember. Was it called Penultima? 
I don't think so. Let me look. It's one of the earliest, so that should be very easy to find. I'll just do search for 7800 mm. until... Actually, I can just... It highlights it. Let's see. I'll put it on the screen so you guys can see it too. Um, so we just scroll back, and these are all the 7800 games. When did we start playing 78? Well, we've been playing for a while. First 7800 game. No, still more. Oh, still more. Uh, nope. Okay. That was awards. Uh, Million Molly was the first game we played. Mm. <clears throat> um, Million Molly, Dragon's Cash, Spire of the Ancients, Castle Days, EXO, uh, Spire of the Ancients, Popeye, Roach in Space 2, Danger Zone, mm. uh, nope, Santa Simon, Uniwars, Chase, Nope. It's it's like one tubes time salvo raindrops exo uh, get lost. Mm. That's what it was. Because you could get lost in this one. Remember? Oh, With the dragons yeah. breathing fire. So so good. It was a good game. Yeah, that was an excellent. That wasn't what I was thinking of, but that that is an excellent. So game. that was on um, April a year ago. Second. Yeah. Now let's ish. see when the dragonfly came into play. Mm. That was a really fun game. I, I remember that. It. Dragonfly. Oh no, we already had the dragonfly by then. Mm. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Yeah, Get Lost. It, Excellent it's game. Awesome game, but it crashes at a certain point, and the developer couldn't figure out why it crashes oh, at that I see. point. Yeah. So they couldn't fix it. Oh. And I think it was random when it crashed. Okay. Like it wasn't at a specific spot. And so we're like, well, it crashes. We can't play it. Like you just, yeah. you can't finish the game. Yeah. But we explored a bunch of different areas, like as many areas as we could. It's awesome. Mm hmm. Huge map, four-way scrolling. You can jump and yep. fall yep. and climb up ladders and stuff. It's so, so good. And it's mm -hmm. very, very much like a Pitfall game, like Pitfall 2 type of game. Mm. So if you haven't played it, uh, give it a try. Yeah. It's really, really cool. It will crash at a certain point, So, but it's fun to play while it still works. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, like I said, we are going to have Muddy Vision Secret Homebrew. Uh, on Friday, and then one more show, and then we're having some time off, and then we come back with Atari Age Day 2022. We're doing a ton of unboxing, mm. speaking to all the developers live through video chat, and uh, playing their games a little bit. Awesome. And it'll be a lot of fun. I so get to play a lot of games. Definitely want to tune in. I love in. it. She gets to play games I for six play hours. Games. James does all the talking, I do all the game playing. I think you played so almost all fun. of them. Have Except I? Except maybe some point? The, not the 5200 game, but I believe you played all the rest it's of them. It's so much fun. Was well, there's some Jaguar games? So there's some Jaguar oh, games. Yeah, we'll be able to play those. Would not have played. Yeah. Could be. Yeah. So I'll have all the systems set up, ready to go. Mm. Probably put the Jaguar where the 8 bit is. Okay. And the 5200 on We're going to do it down here, right? This, yeah. this time, yeah. Upstairs was. It wasn't really necessary. It's fine. We have a computer upstairs now. So we can yeah, do it. But, but I mean, it wasn't necessary. It wasn't it that was much necessary. of a change. And we ended up lugging everything upstairs, Ugh. and it's kind of just easy Especially to do Especially all these systems, there's yeah. no way. There's, yeah. no, there's no point. Yeah. We're in front of the fireplace. Yeah. It was like, yeah. nobody cared. <laughs> it was so much work. Yeah. Oh, my God. So, yeah, we're going to we do, do it down it here. here. I think so. Anything we can do to us, like... You can hang stuff in the back here. Put, put some Atari Age posters. Atari Age stickers. Yeah. We, there must oh. be posters that have come with some of the games. There are, but... Or t-shirts. Just hang all the t-shirts in the back. I don't know. Do, I don't we know. must have some things we can put up I have there. an Atari Age t-shirt. Yeah. Um, I don't know. We'll find some stuff. I think Figure we can it find out. some stuff. Yeah. Maybe I'll put all the boxes on that shelf yeah. above us or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something like that. We can make it work. Yep. Um, Zark Stars oh, yeah. posters and shirts. <laughs> yeah. I can't wait to try on that shirt. Oh. That oh, we is put super them on. cute. Oh, we'll we'll the, put them on for the next show. In the break. They're super, super cute. So tiny. I know. Are going to fit that one? Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, no, that'll fit. Not a uh, yeah, it'll fit. It's going to be tight. It will be tight. 
which I don't <laughs> mind. <laughs> <laughs> it'll be no, it'll fit. It'll fit. Yeah. Yeah. So it's these. nice. No, <laughs> it's nothing to do with Atari age. No, <laughs> that has to be Atari age stuff. That would be, yeah. Funny, funny, funny. Yeah. Fun stuff. Okay, thanks for Ooh. hanging out. Make it fit. <laughs> Can you Shove make it on? Not really. Can you put like holes in the side? Oh, you side could you could cut it and put an insert in the side. Like you could totally do cut that. Cut the sides and and pin them with all pins, safety pins. Make yeah. it punk. Yeah, punk, yeah. Punk shirt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There are a few shirts I've wanted to like crop too and make yeah. them shorter because I don't necessarily like super long shirts. So the shirts are actually really cool looking. I really like them. I love the guy with the like, brain in it. The brain guy. This is Dark Stars 3 or 2? I can't remember. That's... 2. Uh, no, two, 2 is going through the hall. So here's the brain guy, and this is number 1. Okay. But this that's is... That's going num- through the hall. That's number 2. This is number 2. With the city. Yes, okay. I, I know them all, but I just... Yeah. There's number 1. With the brain guy. Yeah. Hold it up. Yep. Yep. Woo! Very nice. Look at that. There you go. Love them. That was in the the other show. Yeah. If you missed that one. <laughs> yeah. Very nice color contrast with yeah. the orange and blue Very too. Nice. Love it. Thanks for hanging out for in the after dark, watching us get frustrated as hell playing INV Plus, but I did get fourth place. Mm. Probably be bumped down. I'll I'll be top ten at the end, I'm sure. It's yeah. halfway through. Most yeah. people put in their scores. Mm-hmm. Some people wait to the end and go, Oh, what do I have to beat? That's yeah. what I usually do. Yeah. Because I usually only play it once. Well, you're going to push yourself to try and get it, get on the scoreboard, right? Yeah. yeah. And I don't know if I could do much better. Yeah. Like, if I played another couple hours or another couple rounds, mm. I could do a little bit better. I'm not getting 9990. Mm. The invaders will be at the bottom of the screen <laughs> yeah. immediately. Um, so thanks for hanging out. RC70, Chelsea Donnie Mao. Chelsea Donnie Mao? Chelsea Donnie Mao. Yeah. Chelsea Donnie Mao. Chelsea Donnie. That's what I'm missing. Chelsea Donnie. Donnie? I don't know. Chelsea Donnie Mao. <laughs> That's how I say it. Metal Inner 7. You were right. Charles uh, Whelan. Charles Whelan. Toko. Old Style. Old Style. Rendered uh, Ghost. Head Blender. Head Blender. Who, great thank name. you for following. Great name. Yeah. There's a, uh, Metal show. Metal? Oh, it's called Flex Your Head, not... Flex head. Your Head? Close. Head Blender, Flex uh, Your Head. okay. Um, stinky Cats. Ross oh. Jester. Ross oh. O'Jester. Ross O'Jester. That's yeah. a newish name. In a newish name, yeah. Tower Collection. I think we're oh, getting back no, into the, in, the uh, in the old show. You got your name set already. <laughs> um, so we're back on Friday with a mystery homebrew Yay. from Muddy Vision. Yay. So have a good night and have a good week and we'll see you on Friday. On Friday. Bye-bye. Bye.